that at bat or just the whole inning if you want to? Oh uh, yeah, that last at bat, Schreiber put the bun on and uh, didn't get it down the first two times and then the two strikes and uh, I just felt confident. I've been feeling confident all day and just got to get pitched and hit. Got to get hit. When was your last uh, career walk off? High school? Oh man, yeah, I can't even remember. It must have been high school. Is that one of the most exciting things to do, at, especially on your home field? Yeah, definitely. What do you think? What do you think about the defense up the middle, uh, especially uh, strong there? Second, he had a few nice plays. Yeah, me and Cody have been working out a lot, and you know he's he's gotten a lot better. We have both gotten better together. And we're definitely helping out the defense a lot. Was uh, Dressler the kind of perfect guy to be in there for much of the game today, being that he works quickly and throws strikes? Yeah, he was, especially on a cold day like today. He was throwing strikes, getting quick outs, helped us out a lot. You get mobbed pretty good after that hit? Yeah. What uh, what pitch? It looked like you went opposite way. Was it just a fastball on the outside corner? Yeah, it was a fastball and with uh, two strikes. Side armor like that, uh, tough matchup. It was it a help that you'd seen him before? Uh, yeah, we've seen a couple pitchers like that before. The key is you just gotta let the ball travel and just, just focus on hitting the ball on the ground. How are you feeling at the plate overall? You, I mean, you reach base every single time. Uh, these past few games, I've been feeling really confident. It just carried over into today. I mean, it's been that way for us. I think, you know, our games against Penn State, games against Michigan State, I thought that we had opportunities. Louisville, we had opportunities, and we just couldn't get a big hit. Um, fortunately, our pitchers, you know, kept putting some zeros up, which allowed us to, you know, you know, have some ABs there late. Um, but I thought Brandon Craig did a nice job on that at bat. I mean, you know, going from bunting to, you know, having one strike left. And then that's really what he's been working on, too, is going that opposite field and staying, uh, you know, line drive, hard ground ball that way. So it's good for him to, see, you know, to, to see him do that. Another one of those wins where everybody contributed. Uh, Evac gets a triple, steals a big base in extra innings. Uh, nice to see one through nine contribute to a nice home win. Yeah, and, uh, you know, Mullen came off the bench and, and had a nice uh, sack bunt. Um, we didn't take advantage of it, but I mean, you know, he he came in and, and did a good job off the bench, and um, yeah, I thought it was, you know, definitely a lot of different guys contributed, and, and even pitching wise, I thought again, uh, Dressler did a nice job, Eichmann, uh, you know, did a nice job, Timmy came in, and got the one out that he needed, so um, you know, really another good team win. How'd you guys get through playing this tough conditions with the weather? Well, I actually thought it warmed up as the day went on, just because the sun came out. Um, we're down a little bit out of the wind with the uh, with the stadium being you know a little bit sunken down. Uh, the wind died down a little bit, but um, you know it, it's a tough. It was a tough day. I mean, really, it's usually a tough day for hitters when it's that cold. Uh, and you know, Butler I thought did a nice job. Their hitters did a nice job, and you know we did a pretty good job early, and then we're, we're quieted there for uh, a few innings, but. You know, again, we had those opportunities. They gave us some free bases and some opportunities that we didn't cash in on. So it was good to see that, uh, you know, BK came up with that big hit late. What do you think about Hudnall's home run? He must have really crushed that with this weather. And do you think the yeah, wind helped that out a little bit? I, yeah, I think the wind did help it. I mean, it was a pitch up out of the zone. And so those are really tough to, to get behind. Uh, and his approach to it, I, I think what he did was he hit it high enough that it was above the stadium where the wind could get to it. Mm -hmm. And it helped it get out. If it was a little bit lower, you know, I have a feeling the stadium might have blocked some of that wind, but he hit it so high and barreled it enough uh, you know, that it got out. But, you know, games here, I mean, most of the home runs are in the bullpen, so you got you got to pull it down the line a little bit, and, and you know, he got one. Both Hudnall and uh, Craig said Dressler was kind of the perfect guy to have on the mound for much of the game, working fast, throwing strikes on a cold day. Yeah, because that's the thing is you don't want to be out there on defense in a long inning because even for the pitcher, I think you start, you know, your hand gets cold and you start losing a little bit of dexterity and it makes it a little bit tougher to grip. Um, you know, you don't probably have as good a command. And, and then the longer the inning goes, the same thing with those infielders and outfielders. I mean, their first step probably gets a little slower and their arms, you know, can get a little tight. Um, so, yeah, you want those quick one, two, three innings and, and Dressler did work, you know, quick and, and, and uh, you know, I thought Eichmann did as well. I thought those guys did a good job. And the defense kind of responded to that. I saw Strong had a few nice plays in second. Um, Hunnall had a diving catch out in right field. What yeah, that? and those are difference makers. I mean, those those uh, if that gets by HUD, those that's probably uh, at least a run. Um, same thing with Cody. Uh, you know, 
bases loaded, nobody out. I mean, that base hit, I mean, that inning could get really big. So we get the two outs there. Now they wound up getting a second run out of that inning, but we still minimized, I thought, with bases loaded, nobody out. But that probably is the defensive play of the game. Plus, he had the one, you know, up the middle. They had to throw on the run, and Kyle Wood did a good job at first base, I thought, picking some balls. So, um, you know, Picciotti doesn't get to catch as much, and so, you know, for him to go, uh, you know, uh, the 10 innings was good. Um, a couple plays we thought, you know, uh, he could have blocked maybe one ball or whatever, but, you know, you know, he did a good job, I thought, working with the pitchers. So it was uh, it was a good defensive day for us again. I like we barreled that one. It got it the win. And he had that diving catch in right field. He must really like right field. <laughs> I mean, it's a little tough today with the sun. As you can see, I think Butler had a couple plays where they were struggling with it. But as long as you put your glove up and just keep your head down, it should be all right. And how did you deal with the weather today? Really cold. Um, a little bit of wind. Yeah, how'd you guys deal with it? <laughs> Not good. No. Not good. Yeah, it was really cold today. But I mean, we've been uh, playing with this all year, so I think we're starting to get used to it now. Just hoping let's get some warm weather coming in. Is a walk-off win at home one of the most exciting things in baseball? Um, for us, especially as of right now, because we've been struggling with the one-run uh, one run games, so getting a walk-off win right now at home, especially, is a great time. What was uh, what was the feeling like in those late innings after you know squaring the bases loaded multiple times like that? That it was finally going to come? Um, I was feeling like we we've been feeling like this whole season. You know, like we've been getting runners in scoring position, we've been struggling to get them in, but then BK did a great job on a one-two count to drive the ball the other way, and was, I think it was a five ball, so that was good for him. Another great outing by Dressler against Butler. What did you see from him? Um, Dressler's been pretty good against Butler all year. I think he's pitched uh, all three times, but I mean, he's been uh, commanding with his off-speed pitches, which has been keeping batters off, like off, uh, they've been struggling with it. So he did a good job, he came in commanding the zone, especially in the uh, bases loaded. And it has to be the best kind of pitcher to pit, play behind today on a cold day like this, throwing strikes, <laughs> keeping the game moving. As long as we were getting the game moving and not walking people, I was happy with that. But yeah, he did a good job today.